what this offense was capable of coming in. Did they kind of uh, meet expectations uh, today? Yes, sir, they definitely did. You know, they're number two in the country for a reason. But still, as a defense, we, we should know our assignment, know what we have to do to combat that. And, and as a defense, we have a lot of growing to do, and we know we have to get done. Was, After we watch the film and stuff, we, we, we have a long ways to go, but we, we, they're definitely as good as we expected. Was it the speed, Eddie? I mean, there were six straight possessions where they were able to get touchdowns on you. What was maybe the biggest difference, just their skill set or just missed a sign? In your mind, what was the difference? In my mind, I feel that I can't really uh, single out just one specific thing, but as far as like a unit and an offense, they, they definitely work together well and, and uh, moved as a unit definitely as well. If you were giving a future team the season advice on, on how to beat Oregon and what your best guess would be, if, are there things that you felt like uh, were weaknesses of the team? I know they're number two in the country. But, yes, sir. Uh, but if, but if, uh, if a Stanford or a UCLA were to beat them down the road, uh, do you have any advice on how you might go about that? I would say as a defense, just you know, uh, there's no secrets to football. There, there's no secret formula, secret potion to, to winning games. It's simply stop their offense and, uh, and, and know your assignment and do your job. Football is not really a, a secret potion or, or a hint because it's pretty much all out in the open. So just play hard and, and, uh, and, and go in expecting to win. Eddie, what do you think of the stadium environment and the noise level? Um, for me personally, it didn't really affect me at all because I played my my first game ever was Texas at Texas. So uh, as far as the noise, noise and uh, the crowd noise it didn't really affect me at all. But it's a beautiful stadium. Eddie, when you say the defense has to grow, I mean, you've been through these situations before. Are you confident that you guys are, you know, not just the defense, but this entire team will grow from this and learn from this? Or is this something that might be hard to get over uh, oh, looking ahead? Oh, 100% confident in our team. Uh, from not, not to bring back last year, but our mentality and just as a unit, even going into, just like I said uh, last, last week, coming out of halftime, going into halftime, our team was still calm, cool, collected, saying, like, hey, we're going to come back and win this game. Down to the last little to the, to, to the fat lady saying, we, we're going to come back and win this game. It's going to come our way. So as far as morale and, and constructive criticism going into the next game, we know what we have to do. And we're, we're definitely excited to, to, to get back to work on Monday because, you know, uh, get this taste out of our mouth and, uh, and go and put in a good week's work. Eddie, I know, you know, they have a good offensive line, but, uh, you know, how elusive, I guess, was, was Mariota where he, anytime you guys got relatively close to him, it seemed like he was able to wiggle out a little bit. Yes, sir. Bit. Definitely, definitely a great athlete. Definitely a great a athlete. And uh, as far as when we got close to him, uh, he, he he's definitely been in that situation before, and he executed his assignment.